my channel. It's Re. Thank you for joining me today for this 19 item Ulta haul. Yes, 19 items. No, I didn't spend a lot of money. I had coupons and rewards. We'll get to that in a second. But before we do, go grab yourself a snack. Go grab yourself a drink. I've got my drink right here. I'm drinking sparkling ice, peach nectarine. It's not sponsored. My sister's gonna make fun of me for saying that, but <sighs> whatever. Um, we will get started here in a minute. Just wanted to thank my aunt for helping me do this. Uh, she's amazing, obviously. I would like to say that I spent $99.16. I had $14 off because of my rewards and $3.50 off of a $15 purchase. Alrighty, I have all of my items written down with the prices because it didn't give me a sheet. But here it is. Here it is, y'all. 19 items. We're going to get through this. My sister dug through this to see what I all I got. So that's why it's already opened. But I got these simple Sensitive Skin Experts Kind of Skin Cleansing Wipes. I've used these before. They're really nice. You can also get them at Walmart. Um, these were $2.39 for seven wipes. I don't know where to put this. I'm just going to throw it on the ground. I also got this Makeup Revolution London Reloaded Palette. Uh, it's the Visionary. Very beautiful palette. Let me open it up. This was on sale for $3.00 and 49 cents which is a freaking steal because it has 15 shades like what 15 shades for sticky for three dollars and 49 cents and i've used these palettes so i know how well they work Look at that. Look at that purple right there and the pink and that one. Oh, I'm going to swatch this one. Let's swatch on this hand. A little chalky, but still so beautiful, so buttery. I can't wait to use this. This is going to be so exciting. Oh, my gosh. I can't wait. Next into my box of tricks, I got the Vivid Brights colored liner in what shade did I get? Vivid Fire. I've been wanting colored liners for a while just because I want to do more creative looks and not just your everyday. And I'm hoping these will help. If you've used these before, let me know. I haven't used them before, so there's that let's see how it looks it's very pretty Ooh, maybe not with the purple but whatever i got two of these uh one in a different shade i think i got a yellow but we'll find it in there there's that those are both where is it uh, $4.90. I believe they were on sale. I also got the Essence Duo Duo Sharpener for $1.99. I have a lot of lip liners and I have some eyeliners that I need to sharpen because they are so dull at this point. I've just been like avoiding buying it. I got a free with purchase a little baggie. You had to spend $10 on any NYX products. And I got quite a bit of NYX products. So, 
if you like NYX, that's great. You're gonna have to clean it so much. Anyway, it's a really cute bag. I love it. Did anything come in it? No. These will be great for my brushes because they, it opens up so wide and it's so long. Perfect. Super excited about that. What else is NYX? Y'all are not ready for how cute this thing is going to be. It's by I Heart Revolution. I think it's a sister brand of Makeup Revolution. Don't quote me on that because I'm not 100% sure. But it is called the Donuts Palette Raspberry Icing. So freaking cute. It's squishy on top, which is also awesome. Um, I bought this just because I wanted to try. I can't even open this box. I wanted to try the palette, but also I just wanted like a cute palette to showcase. And I love cute little things like this. I am not returning this apparently, so just going to destroy the box. Ready? 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 There we go. It's so cute. I love it. Look. It's squishy on top. Look how cute this palette is. I love it. I love it. Let's swatch. What shade shall we swatch? Kind of digging this darkest color right here. What? That's so nice. I was super nervous about buying this because, oh my God, someone said it wasn't good. Don't listen to people, y'all. I mean, listen to me because I know what I'm talking about. <laughs> but don't. Oh my gosh, that was so nice. I'm so, I'm so shocked. There it is. Wanted to put the thing back in there. Wow. I'm Okay, I'm going to swatch another one. What other one should we swatch? I want to swatch a matte one. I have not had any caffeine today. I'm, oh my God. I have a feeling I'm going to use this for my Tangled inspired eye look. Cause that pink, so freaking cute. So cute. So stoked I bought that. All right. <laughs> oh, I got that for, let's see, $7. I might go and buy the other ones. I think there's like three other shades. There's a blue one. Pretty sure there's a brown one. And I might just have to go buy them all. Like I said, I like sets. I like buying sets. All right, I had someone request me to try the Burt's Bees makeup. I'm buying stuff here and there, but I bought this Burt's Bees liquid lipstick for $2.49. I've heard these, this makeup brand is also not that great. So we'll see. If I can even open it. Okay, there it is. Oh, that smells weird. It smells like, you know those gummies, like gummy candies? It smells like those. I don't know if this is supposed to be matte or not. I'm not guessing it. It is. I don't really like the scent. Um, this is called Sandy Seas. It's that one right there. I'm gonna give it a shot, just cause I'm not a quitter. Oh, my paper. Every video, every video I drop something. I got Lock On Liner and Brow Cream and Espresso by Elf for four dollars yeah four dollars i had a friend on facebook 
Her Instagram is Enchanting Beauty MUA or something like, like that. I'll tag her down below. She uses this in every single one of her pictures, and I die over her eyebrows all the time. I want my eyebrows to look like hers, so I bought the product she uses, hoping. What is next in my box of magic tricks? Ooh, I bought the new Juvia's Place I Am Magic Velvety Matte Foundation in shade Vienna. This was $20. This was the most expensive item I bought, but, and for that size? Okay. I'm not mad at it. It's closed right now and I don't feel like opening it quite yet just because I am going through a few different foundations right now. But I wanted to try this. I've heard great things about it. I'm hoping I got the right shade. There's that. Let's see. I'm just diving on in. A Super Stay Matte Ink in Lover. I just talked about these in a different video. Uh, I think I've posted it already by the time you're seeing this. But I'm not sure. I haven't decided which order my videos are going in yet. Anyways, it's a nice pink shade. I don't have a lot of pink lipsticks. Like, true pinks. That... I can recall at the moment. Ooh, this one's heavy. Oh, those are $9.49. I got one for $4.75 because it was buy one, get one half off. So I have another one in the box somewhere. I just haven't found it yet. All right. Bear With Me Hydrating Jelly Primer by NYX. I bought two different primers just because I'm looking for a new one. This is infused with aloe and cucumber. It came out with a whole Bear With Me line that I'm wanting to pick up the rest of. I just, it's a little bit pricier, but I couldn't, I couldn't resist this. Ooh, I don't want to open it just because it has the plastic on it. So we'll probably use this in an upcoming video just to test out with one of my all-time favorite foundations just to see how it works. That was $11.90. $11.90. Have another bigger item from e.l.f., the Super Hydrate moisturizer with hydrating squalane i don't know what squalane is so uh plant derived squalane whatever that means moisturizes deeply improves moisture balance and elasticity gives thirsty i read that and it sounded like they repeated themselves twice. This was $12. Elf products are amazing. I love their skincare lines. I'm planning on getting more. I always plan on shopping. I have a shopping addiction. This is what it looks like when you open it. Then you just pull. Ooh, I love this packaging. Look how cute that is. It's glass or it's plastic. And it also has that plastic. We are just moving on through this thing, huh? This looks so nice. I hope it doesn't smell very, like a lot. Just because I have a hard time with some scents. Same with that primer. Alrighty. Let's get on. Bubble wrap. And we have the elusive 
Poreless Primer by e.l.f. The Putty Primer. I, it's $8. Every time I went to go buy it, it was out of stock. Just because it's such a cult favorite at this point. I think, like, everyone has done a video on it. Everyone has tried it. Everyone loves it. Um, they say it's uh, comparable to Tatcha's primer. I haven't used Tatcha's primer, so I wouldn't know. I also haven't used the poreless one yet. So we'll see how that goes. That was $8. More packaging stuff. We are almost through it, you guys. Okay. Now we just have some liner, some concealer, and more lipsticks. Uh, the Vivid Brights Colored Liquid Liner, priced at $4.90, I believe I said. Yeah, this one is a Vivid Halo. I'm hoping I have a I look for Winnie the Pooh that I want to do, and I'm hoping this color is deep enough I don't think it will be just because it looks more pastel yellow not honey yellow but that's okay we'll work with what we've got this lipstick is still not dried down I'm not complaining though all right oh I could probably use that that's what that looks like very very pretty We'll see how that goes. I'll probably have some videos up for some looks here soon. The Maybelline Superstay Matte Ink in Philosopher. It's a light lavender color. Oh, I forgot to tell you guys. While I was shopping, I couldn't decide which shades to get of the Matte Superstay. Just because I love them so much and I like all of the colors. So I had my mom choose on the premise that I give her a shout out in my video that she chose one of these colors. I can't remember which one she chose, but she chose one of them. So thank you, mom, for helping your girl out with her shopping addiction. Uh, that was, one of them was for $4.75, one was for $9.49. That's just because I got buy one half off. That's what I got a lot of these products for. I don't typically buy full price and then not like have, you know, I like to get my full money's worth. I also got Cleans and Condition Blow Dry Glotion. I love Biolage, Biolage, whatever it's called. Little sample, I love samples. Where did my paper go? Oh, it's in here. A little all over the place today. So for NYX, I got the Strictly Vinyl Lip Gloss in shade SVLG. It's a purple shade. I love purples. I think they complement my lips the most. Alrighty. This is, it looks like it's going to be a more brown color. Let's just swatch on this hand. Ooh, my, I have some hair on my hands, so it feels weird. But it doesn't smell like anything, so that's nice. And it does look a little brown more than purple. I'll experiment with that. Uh, we have a lip oil from e.l.f. That was $6. Uh, the Strictly Vinyl Lip Gloss was $2.99. Forgot to tell you that. Uh, it's a little corally shade. I just got it for work. Just so it's hydrating and it looks nice on the skin. Um, this is in Coral Kiss, $6. Very pretty. And I got the... LA Girl Pro Conceal. Hopefully it's my shade. Um, in the shade Fairest for, where is it? 
$2.99. I remember when everyone was using this to cover their eyes, to go under their under eyes um, in every video. And I finally am trying that out. And then the last item I got was J-Cat Beauty, the big eye pencil in Marshmallow, I think it was. Where is the name? Oh yeah, Marshmallow. Just to go in my under eye, because it's supposed to wake you up, make you look nice and refreshed, which your girl needs. So, hoping I didn't get lipstick all over my pants. Um, the last item that I had never got here. It was a Wet n Wild Shimmer Palette. It was like this bronzy, blushy kind of palette. I bought it because it reminded me of the Laura Geller palette of blushes that I think went out of stock and are not returning. So I wanted to get a dupe and see if they were, you know, similar. But that's it, y'all. We made it through. We made it through. What was your favorite item out of the haul? I, for me, it has to be that donut palette. I was not expecting how pretty these shades were. Um, and I can't wait to play with it. If you want to see anything used, if you have any eye looks or any face looks that you want me to try out, um, just let me know. Let me know what you want to see. I'm always here for you guys. Um, thank you for letting me have a shopping addiction. Now I can justify it because I'm like, oh, it's for YouTube, a YouTube video. It's fine, you know. My husband might not think so, but whatever. I'm, I'm under control. Did any of you believe that? Anyway, I will be filming some videos, some try-on videos uh, with the primers. I'll be doing some testing videos with the eyeshadows, of course. Uh, if you want to see anything else, just let me know. Write down in the comments what your favorite item was of the haul and what you'd like to see next. Have a good weekend. You deserve it, babies. Have a good day. Bye.